What's going on guys, Cosmic Collector here, and today we'll be unboxing the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse Batman Hush Statue. Alright guys, so for this video we'll be unboxing the Batman Hush Statue in the DC Multiverse line. We'll take a quick look at the box. Here's the side, McFarlane Toys. Here's a look at the back with that Jim Lee art. Let's look at the other side. Here's a look at the top. Here's the bottom. Now let's get into the unboxing. All right, now that we got that unboxed, we'll go ahead and just attach it to the base stand so it'll stand up. This is a matte black, and it has the DC logo there. All right, so the base just pegs into his feet, and here's a look at the card it came with. Here's a look at the back if anyone wants to pause and read that. This is a nice card. I'll have to sleeve it up after I'm done recording this video. Now let's go ahead and take a closer look at the statue. Alright, based on first impressions, this is a beautiful statue. The sculpt and paint are perfect, and I love this iconic pose. The paint and the detailing is really well done. We have texture on the boots and on the gray part of his costume. The utility belt looks great, it's well sculpted, and the yellow looks really good. The bat symbol on his chest pops out a little bit, so it gives it that 3D effect. The sculpt and the anatomy is also done very well. You can see the cloth wrinkles on his costume. There's even scratches to indicate previous battles. It's a semi-dynamic pose. He's walking forward and grabbing his cape, making it flow in the wind. I was expecting the cape to be a stiff, solid piece, but it's actually pliable and more of like a rubber material, which is ideal to avoid breakages. The cowl and face sculpt is also done very well. They really capture the comic book likeness, and I love the white eyes. I love the attention to detail with the wrinkles on his costume and cape. And I can't find a single flaw with this statue. This is an amazing statue. I'd highly recommend picking it up for any Batman fans. The blue and grey Batman costume is my favorite, so I'm really glad to have this in my collection. What's going on guys, Cosmic and Post here to remind you to head over to the community tab on my page, vote on the most recent poll for which IP you'd like in the upcoming giveaway at 500 subs. Alright, now for the size of the figure. As we've seen on the card it came with, this is approximately 8 12 inches, but we'll go ahead and measure it. This statue actually stands just about 10 half inches, or about 26 half centimeters. For size comparison, here it is next to a Funko Pop, and here it is next to a Funko Auto Box. Here it is next to a Diamond Select Spider-Man statue. And here it is next to the King of Artists, Shanks figure. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this video. Once again, this is a great statue and I highly recommend picking it up if you're a Batman fan. Please let me know what you thought of this statue down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. And if you're not already, please subscribe.